Hello everyone, this is DA from A Academy and today this video is about the relation between the upper Riemann integral and the lower Riemann integral. So let's continue with the definition. So now recalling the definition of the upper Riemann integral. That is, if we have a bounded function f and this is the definition of the upper Riemann integral. Now the definition of the lower Riemann integral is the supremum of all of the lower Riemann sum on the every possible partition. So this is the definition of the upper Riemann integral. This is the this is the definition of the lower Riemann integral that was discussed in the previous video in detail. So now we are going to show the relation between upper Riemann integral and the lower Riemann integral. First of all, we will consider the relation between the infimum and the supremum. So if we if we know that the supremum is the least upper bound. So, if we are going to subtract any possible positive number from the supremum, then there must a number from this set that exceeds uh, the element. So let have so let's we have a positive positive number epsilon by two that is greater than zero. So if we are going to subtract this supremum, and we're going to subtract epsilon by two from the supremum, then the supremum of this whole set of the the supremum of the set that have uh, the lower in lower Riemann sum over every possible or every possible uh, partition so this this is of course less than any element any any lower Riemann sum so there exists a, uh, a sum a lower Riemann sum that is greater than this whole thing so now the same case for the infimum because what is infimum infimum is the greatest lower bound and if we're going to add a possible this number that is greater than zero then there exists an element from this set that is less than that uh, infimum of that set minus epsilon by two so let's write it out so this supremum is is equal to this this notation used for the supremum so this element the supremum minus this positive number is now less than any number that is within this set and here the upper bound the infimum plus a positive number that is now greater than the element from this set now we're going to but now we're going to see the relation of of the lower Riemann sum and the upper Riemann sum we know that for every partition this lower Riemann sum is always less than the upper Riemann sum this is the relation that is that is by definition of the Riemann sum lower and upper. So now if we're going to use this in order to join these two terms, then we have now this is what exactly what is written on the upper above side. And now this is less than the upper Riemann sum. And here and here this is less than this whole thing. So this is less than this uh a to b this is the upper Riemann integral so now we have these terms the upper Riemann integral plus this quantity so now if we're going to if we're going to neglect and if we're going to neglect these terms then we must left out with this and this element so we have this and if this is minus epsilon by 2 moves on the next side of the inequality it will be epsilon by 2 plus epsilon by 2 and this will be equal to epsilon on the next side of the inequality and here because epsilon was arbitrarily a very small positive element so it can be neglected out here so we have this relation of the upper Riemann integral and the lower Riemann integral that upper Riemann integral always greater than the lower Riemann integral and this is same the relation between this the upper Riemann sum is always greater than lower Riemann sum for every partition and the same case in the integral as well. So this is the relation between upper Riemann integral and the lower Riemann integral and that was very important in in the definition of the Riemann integrable functions and to figure out what is uh, how the function is said to be Riemann integral and about the definitions about uh, studying the partitioning of the finer or whatever it is. So this is the relation, this is the important relation between the upper and the lower Riemann integrals. So this is for now. If you for more such videos, then you can subscribe to this channel to watch more upcoming videos. We will meet in the next video. Till then, take care. Goodbye.